Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Ethan here. How you doing? Do it. Hi guys, Ethan here. So today I'm going to make interview video with one member of Kachi. You know that Kachi is like a taboo topic of K-pop and hot topic these days. So I'm going to talk with member Koko. I'm not a fan of K-pop, but I already saw so many criticizing video about Kachi because it's popped up on my recommendation list, and some of my subscribers requested me to make a video about them. So I was searching information about them online. And I just realized that there are so many rumors about them. For example, Korean member Coco cannot speak Korean. I don't think so. She's she born in Korea and raised in Korea, so I'm pretty sure that she might speak Korean. Live information from this interview. It's your choice. Believe it or not. And of course, you can write comments about I don't like them and I don't like their style. I don't like their dancing. I don't like their singing. But you guys, please don't cross the line like death threats. Those kinds of too much thing. I hope you guys won't write those kind of things, please. Anyway, let's go. Hi, Coco. How are you? My name is Ethan. Hey. Hi, I'm Coco. Hi. How are you? you. Nice to meet you. Thank so, you. can I just go with the basic information? Is it okay? Yeah, sure. Uh, what is your real name and how old are you? Your real Korean name. Yeah, my real Korean name is Yeonsu Do Yeonsu. Mm -hmm. And uh. I uh, how to say it because like you know Korean age is quite strange. Ah okay, I I I know how to count it. Uh, so when which which year did you born? Uh, nineteen ninety four. Same as me. And when is your birthday? Uh, Chingu. Chingu, yes. When is your birthday? Uh, January fifth. Uh, so it's passed. I think so. It's twenty sixth. Second question. There is a rumor that you can't speak Korean. Is it true? 한국말 잘하시죠? 그럼요. 한국 사람입니다. 대한민국 사람입니다. 그러니까 저도 이거를 봤는데 그 2016년에 런던으로 가셨다고 하시더라고요. 근데 그러면 그 전에는 한국에 살으셨다는 건데 한국말을 못하는 게 말이 안 되는데 그래서 대학 대학 졸업까지 했습니다. 아, 네, 한국말 잘하시네요. <웃음> and also there is a rumor that you quit Gachi. You quit the member. Uh, the, you quit the group Gachi. Is it true? No, I'm still in Gachi. <웃음> so there are tons of rumors. Yeah, a lot of, I think, yeah, thousands of rumors. And it's just my personal question. Do you like ice cream? Ah, uh, yeah, I do. And if you can choose, what is your favorite uh, flavor? Mm, I love coconut because you know what? My name is Coco. Ah, yeah. I love coconut flavor. One of my subscribers asked me, do you like coconut, to be honest? Sure. Okay, okay. You can choose. Who is your favorite member of Kachi? It's really difficult. Mm -hmm. This is really difficult. Um, cause you know what? Like, um, Nico is really good at taking care of members. Mm -hmm. She's really good, and she's really good dancer. So sometimes I, cause my background is contemporary dance, but mm -hmm. her background is like like street and very powerful, like commercial dance. So that is why I got a lot of um advance. Uh, no, um, uh, what is that? advices from her mm -hmm. and Junza, she's so cute she's so cute my name mm. <laughs> my sis, she's so cute mm -hmm. and then Dani she's so smart she's so smart and then she is really good at organizing so that mm. is why I really love our you know like our members you know in mm. each position so maybe uh the cutest one is Bangne. Uh, Jun's, yeah, uh, okay, so let's say that it's your favorite is Magne. <laughs> okay. Do you like K-pop or is there any favorite genre of music that you like? I like K-pop. Um, I'd like to say I like dance to K-pop because I'm a dancer. And K-pop music is really good and visual, you know, like the performance is amazing. Mm -hmm. But I usually listen to kind of like indie music K mm. I like like calm oh, I like Hyogo called mm -hmm. Adoi um, and like Pegerin or mm. this kind of very calm mood music. Ah, okay oh interesting I checked that you moved to UK and is there any like a specific reason yeah I wanted to study dance more so I've studied um, my master in Trinity Laban 
um, choreography.、Mm-hmm. And then I used to work as choreographer and dancer in you know contemporary、uh, for contemporary dance. And then I did lots of like collaboration work with. Different artists, and then I worked for like music distribution company.、Mm-hmm. At that point, I found like the really good like positive potentiality of K-pop outside of Korea. Actually,、mm. so that is why I think it would be really nice to develop it as a Korean. And、uh, when I came back to London last year, I started like. Just get into K-pop industry community, and then like teaching K-pop and everything.、Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, sounds cool. What is the definition of K-pop for you? What is the definition of K-pop for you? It's,、uh, I, I think it's combination of arts because it's not only music. Because we usually、um, say K-pop is music, but at the same time, dance is really important、mm-hmm. element in K-pop. So, like music, performance, and、um, like art. Music video or fashion styling, makeup, even makeup, everything, and then like the concept is also very important. As a Korean,、uh, how do you think about your members' Korean skill, and are they learning Korean、uh, these days? Yeah, they're re- they're working hard. Okay.、Um, especially Dani, she has um, studied um, Korean like for three years, I think,、mm-hmm. and then she is quite fluent. Um, mm. Korean, and then Junza, she's Junza and Nico. Nico, at the moment she got new Korean textbook, and then she, she just showed us, and then oh, I got it, and then I, I'm really happy to learning, I learn Korean.、Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's they're really working hard to learn Korean. There is rumor that you are、uh, with you are in the same entertainment or label with Oli London. Is it true? No, it's it's all Oli Ayles. Uh, fake rumors, because you know. Fake rumors, okay. Because you know we are under a、uh, front row label.、Mm-hmm. And only London, he has own label, so we are all different. People are calling your members as a Korea boo, and how how do you think about it? Um, I don't think they're Korea boo because you know what, from my perspective as a、mm-hmm. Korean, um, um, I don't think everyone who. I think there is a line like we can say Korea boo or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I <clears throat> yeah when I see my members, they're、mm-hmm. just cute. They're、uh-huh. like Korean culture,、mm-hmm. but it's kind of like different. Korea boo for me, Korea boo means like who are really obsessed with、mm-hmm. Korean culture, but they're not really obsessed with Korean culture. They just love it and respect it. But some people say, "Oh, that's cringe when they do some like cute movement gestures." They're young. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They, when they're, I mean, obviously, when I was young, I did some mistake. Also, I think so, even if I didn't realize it. And yeah, and, and I just want to ask, like,、uh, so I'm in Portugal right now, and I'm going to study three years here. So, am I a Portuguese boo? Please call me Portuguese boo. Yeah. How do you think about foreigners being a K-pop idol? Hmm. You mean in Korea or outside of Korea? Um, can be both.、Mm. In Korea, I think I think this is what we want to do、um, with Kachi because there's so many stereotypes.、Mm-hmm. Like K-pop idols can,、uh, like for example, Korean or only Asians can、mm-hmm. be K-pop idols. I think in terms of like K-pop idol. It might be possible, but for me, I'm just thinking K-pop music as a genre.、Mm-hmm. So it has already its like characteristics, which is different from just normal pop music.、Mm-hmm. So I think for K-pop group, anyone can be K-pop group、uh, musician. People told me that Kachi is not prepared like other other groups. So for how long did you guys、uh, train all together? So we last year there was a、um, K-pop audition, and then Nico and Junsa、um, got casted from that audition. So、mm-hmm. we met just a few months. Yeah, that's the fact. But the thing is,、um, you know, Nico, Dani, Junsa, they、um, they used to work as a K-pop cover dance team、mm-hmm. 
for five years and then they also、um, trained as like as dancer and me as well I've trained as、um, dancer and I've done like dance education so we have our own you know dance training、mm, so you mean、period. Yeah. That's the fact that you guys didn't train all together, but as an individual, you、yeah. you've, you've got trained for a long time. Yeah, sure. Yeah.、Mm. Uh, almost of lyrics is English, not Korean. And how do you think about it?、Mm. I think our、um, yeah, because it it's also、um, I don't know. Let me see.、Mm. Because our members are from、um, Europe. Mm-hmm. Not Korea, so that is why most of language should can be English. But we also put Korea Korean because we want to do K-pop music.、Mm-hmm. But you know, when you see many global K-pop groups like、mm-hmm. idols, they also put lots of like English lyrics in their music.、Mm-hmm. So I think language doesn't really mean a big part in K-pop music. Mm. I would say、mm, it can be like that, but also for me,、uh, it's a K-pop, so it should have a K- Korean lyrics. So I hope you guys, I, mean, I understand that you they are foreigners, so I hope they're going to put more Korean lyrics in the future.、Mm-hmm. Yeah,、okay. because they're studying Korean. Issue with BTS Jungkook? <laughs> you mean are you asking like there's issue with Jungkook? Or is it true? Yeah, is it true that is it true that、uh, you guys are having some issue? With Changu,、um, no, at all. All the rumors related to BTS are false. I 100% can say, yeah. Okay, so you 100% can say that a、uh, rumor about BTS Changu is false. Changu and everything. I think I I've already seen like a logo and、uh, what else? Like the, our next song track, you know.、Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I blew you like blue swan everything. I feel just so sorry to BTS and then BTS fans because all fake, but everyone just really shocked because of that rumor. Ah, okay. And about logo copy and I purple you, I blew you. So it's not a fact that you just copied everything. Just drama. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all of them are drama. Okay. How do you handle the this whole hate and the whole backlash that you get?、Mm-hmm. So I, I'm like, whenever I check on the YouTube, every comments are a lot about the hate, and if I'm you, I would, I would go to the hospital to be honest, because of I have not that strong mental, I would say. Yeah, I think this is kind of the、um, stage to become、um, more popular. I think it's very natural, and then I don't really mind like someone who don't like our music, who don't like us. It's fine, but the thing is. If there is something like、um, very offensive hate or insulting,、um, it's not good. So I don't know other members, but for me, I don't know because I'm the oldest one. So that is why I'm very strict, strict to、um, that kind of like insulting and offensive、mm. things. Because even though they are young, I know most of our fans are really young, but.、Mm-hmm. They don't know what is right, what is wrong. That would be、um, that would affect their life, and then I just I just want to give positive effect rather than like just、um, leave it itself.、Mm-hmm. So that's what I do. But I don't really mind like when I see hate because well I don't mind. People can hate me.、But、for me, I think. Mm, I'm just kind of I don't know it's quite weird but I'm kind of like reposted sometimes. Ah <laughs>、uh, yeah. See yeah. How do you feel if you just see this in the morning and then how do you feel and then they will also feel the same thing. Ah,、uh, you were in Only London's Mirror Mirror music video and how was it and、uh, why did they why did you do it and did they pay you? Um um、uh, actually one of my friend in London. Uh, in London, and、mm-hmm. she just asked me to、um, just 
uh, why 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 don't you do like um, I don't know how to say it. Like she just mentioned about uh, Oli is just take, uh, preparing for his new music video, and then mm-hmm. he's looking for Korean or Asian um, people who can dance. Mm-hmm. And then I think I'm the one. So and I heard about him um, before. And why not? I always think when I just got any suggestion, I always think why not. Mm. And if there is something wrong, I don't then uh, like um, immoral thing. I don't do that. But I don't really mind something weird, unique, strange, fun because it's fun. <laughs> mm-hmm. Did they pay you? I mean, you don't need to tell me about how much they pay. <laughs> I-, I think they um, they didn't. Pay me, I think. I just wanted to do that. Like, I mm. how did how did this opportunity come up for you? Like the opportunity of being a kachi. Being kachi. Mm-hmm. Um, um, I work as a you know K-pop teacher, and then mm-hmm. um, I think um, our producer Monica, she just mm-hmm. um, contact me um, individually, and then she told me that uh, we are preparing. A new K-pop girl band in the UK, and then we are looking for uh, many like candidates, like mm-hmm. for the K-pop band. And then why don't you, um, ooh, yeah, why don't you just join? And then, um, yeah, I I thought quite a long time because of my age. <laughs> mm, yeah, I'm thinking about my age also. Don't worry. Yeah, my age, and the, I know like why keep uh, there are so many K-pop idol like stereotypes. So I don't know, like, but I think the idea, the concept of K- uh, Kachi was mm-hmm. really nice. So that is why, yeah, I think I want to do something meaningful. Mm, okay, mm-hmm. how's your daily routine? Uh, in quarantine. <laughs> uh, let's say uh, not quarantine and quarantine also. Tell me, tell me two points. Okay, um, my usual daily um, routine is um, I think I will work for um, then dance training, dance practice, and mm-hmm. then um, I take a rest. Definitely eat some food, and I also I still keep teaching K-pop dance once a week, but at the time because of quarantine we can't teach, mm-hmm. but. And then I'm studying as well because I'm studying um, dance education at the moment. So mm-hmm. um, studying, and then um, I'm running another project with my friend in London and Korea. Mm-hmm. So just preparing for different kinds of like new projects, and then like doing lots of things. Skincare routine and workout routine. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't do any skincare, so I have no idea about this. I'm not an expert of this, but so yeah, skincare and your workout routine. Um, this is really interesting question. Uh, well, yeah. Can I just um just cry? <laughs> yeah, sure. You can cry. Don't worry. I'm sorry. I I just wash my face. I just take a shower every day. That's my skincare routine. So education is beautiful. Okay, so yeah, remove your okay, remove your makeup and, and put toner, and then mm, what else? Like um, uh, essence, you know that there is a like skin essence. Mm-hmm. I shouldn't look at you, so put some essence. That's okay. It's okay. Mm-hmm. Essence, and then mm, and then put some like eye cream and like all wrinkled wrinkle creams because yeah i'm getting old i'm getting old also and put some more moisturizing mm, and then put lotion and mm-hmm. cream <laughs> that's all yeah how about workout routine oh workout routine um mm-hmm. i usually uh, follow the some of very popular youtuber you know working out and any future plan um i think we keep making our music and mm-hmm. Um, and also we want to do some more performances after the quarantine situation and then if it is possible we want to go to Korea and then do some performance and um, oh and also we um, there will be a documentary about us um, in channel 4 mm-hmm. so it will be 
on um, TV, like in this. Oh yeah, this month actually. Ah, this month. Okay. I do want to say I do appreciate. <laughs> I do appreciate、um, our supporters because even though I know the situation is not really good, there's、mm-hmm. so many rumors, but still there's so many people who support us. So I do appreciate. Mhm. 그리고 한국말로 어, 즐기는 게 일, 인류라는 게 있잖아요. <웃음> 그렇죠. 그 싫어하는 것도 일종의 관심이니까 저는 저는 어, 저는 어차피 이렇게 아. 어... 어차피 이렇게 상황이 됐으니까 저 같으면 그냥 이 관심을 즐길 것 같아요. 어쩔 수 없으니까. 그렇죠, 즐 즐겨야죠. 오늘 정말 감사합니다. I'm not a fan or I stand Kachi, and I just saw that most of the lyrics of their song is written in English. So for me, I really hope they're gonna improve their Korean skill and you know put more Korean lyrics. As a Korean tutor, I could say they're Korean pronunciation is not that bad, not like only London. I would say I can. It's understandable. Anyway, their future is not my business, so good luck for them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you enjoyed it, please subscribe to my channel and like my video. Ciao, guys.